We are here with Saeed Faraj. Now, oh, Saeed, I know. Look at this. Look at this smiling face. Okay. Now, I always see you at all of these, you know, fabulous events all over. And I know you're always busy working on movies. Yes. Didn't you say something about the Green Zone? Uh, green Zone was the be beginning of all these interviews and all this red carpets that I'm really so humbled and thanking uh, Paul all the time uh, for... for uh, having me be part of this film but mm -hmm. I'm really excited to give you great news exclusive on your What's on that? this ready well today I submit my uh, first film uh, as a sh as short film I produced it and I star in it and I have uh, it's called the American failure and I submitted to Dubai International Film Festival now what's it called again the, the, American? the American failure okay and what's uh, what's awesome about it is have a great cast which is uh, uh, Hakim Kaikazim Adrian Wilkinson, Dan Thiel. I mean, I'm really excited. This have great composing, uh, great. I mean, it's, it's have everything that I I asked for in this film, and uh, it's, it's the first step because I, it was all uh, labor of love in this film, and uh, and also I uh, start. Uh, I we just wrapped the film called Ten by Ten. Mm -hmm. It's a great story about uh, about uh, educating girls that been raped. Oh, girls okay. that been raped. And uh, what happened is that I have, I want to introduce you to a superstar that she came from Egypt. Mm -hmm. Her name is Mona Hala. Ooh. Oh, hello Mona. Hi. And, Beautiful. And Thank she you. is one of the lead of the, of the film. And I'm really excited about it to introduce you to her. Ah. Now he's been bragging about you behind your back. Is that okay? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's not going to talk very bad about me. <laughs> I try not to. I try not to. <laughs> now you, you're a superstar, at Mona. Can you say your last name again? My name is Mona Hala. Mm -hmm. Hala is my last name. H A L A. H A L A. Oh, yeah. and you are a. Where are you from originally? I'm half Egyptian, half Austrian. Oh, that's <laughs> and I just came. Look. Yeah, yeah. I just came from Egypt like two weeks ago. Oh, you did. So how yeah. do you like it out here? I love it. Last year I was in New York, but I love LA more. Uh -oh, Fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm so sorry, LA guys. LA. <laughs> <laughs> LA, LA is the place, you know. Yeah, especially I, I Hollywood. Hall, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's now, lovely. As far as Egypt, because she looks like an Egyptian princess, right? Thank you. <laughs> what was your favorite role to play from Egypt? Uh, in Egypt, I usually play uh, comedy. I'm a comedian in Egypt. Yeah. But sometimes I, I do some tragedy. But I love this comedy. This one, 10 by 10. 10 by 10 She's is very brilliant. tragedy. <laughs> She's very, I mean, she really, really took took the comedy in a completely different direction. So are you, Thank can you, you do um, comedic tragedy? Or, yeah, or like, like, a, like a dramedy? My yeah. comedy, no, my comedy is kind of a, a black comedy. Uh -huh. We call it pla black comedy. Oh, you're not referring to his suit, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing black too. <laughs> we all wear black. It, it, to keep our shape, it, to keep, it make us look good. Yeah. <laughs> ah, so but, okay, if you were to bring a little bit of Egypt mm -hmm. into the United States, what would you do? Um, the revolution. Uh -huh. I'll bring the revolution with me. <laughs> Ooh, she's a firecracker. Watch out yeah, for mom. Big time. <laughs> <laughs> the movie that you're working on with Say like, yeah. is what is it? It's about the edu uh, uh, educated um, education for girls, for uh -huh. little girls, because you know um, most of the people in the Middle East they don't have the money to send the girls to the mm. schools, so they had a l they have a lot of problems like getting raped or something. So. Really bad. Yeah, 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 big time. So we're discussing. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll break right there. Okay, so, cool. So tell us about the little girls. Okay, the little girls in Egypt. Uh, we have a lot of family, poor families in Egypt. They don't send the girls to the school to get their education. So they have a lot of problems like getting raped and working in, uh, in a very young age to help the family. So in this, in this movie, we're um, talking about such That's, a subject. Yeah. It's a heavy subject, but yeah, I bet yeah. it's very rewarding for you. Yeah, uh, I'm playing the, the mother of the little girl. She's 12 oh. years old and I'm the mother of her. 
Wow. Yeah. That's I'm not too old. <laughs> but you know, I know how you said it's a 12 year old girl, right? <laughs> so let's see, a 12 year old girl, and you're the mother. So she's like, tw you're like 25 in the movie. <laughs> uh, I'm like, no, I'm like 30. <laughs> okay. 30, yeah. It's not that. Uh, <laughs> I'm uh, almost 28, so yeah, yeah. it's good. <laughs> 28 is good. Good, 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 good age. Good age? Yeah. yeah. So did that, playing that movie, did it change you? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And it will change a lot of um, yes. meanings for the people as well, for the audience. Because, you know, um, a lot of people, they don't know m here, mm -hmm. especially, they don't know more about uh, the, what's happening, over, what's there happening the over there in the Middle East for the kids, for the girls especially. Because, you know, we're suffering a lot from racism against girls and yeah. women. So, yeah, we're trying to move everything to the good side. Wow, that'll be an eye-opening experience when people see the yeah. documentary. Yeah. Now, if people want to find out more information about it on the Internet, where's the best place to go? My side. Yeah. <laughs> IMDb. Well, uh, yeah. well, well uh, soon, soon it go, uh, it's actually going to go on IMDb, but uh, for the moment right now we're trying to build everything around it and we're trying to bring uh, uh, a, a IMDb for her and, and we're trying to build a, a website that represents Mona uh, in the United States. And from my side, of course, as you know, I have Facebook uh, and for the people who doesn't know, SAID. F A R A J, and if you cannot find it on somehow on Facebook, I'm on Twitter. I have my web page. You can Google my name. Go to IMDb. Go <laughs> to IMDb. It's easier. <laughs> but, but also need to bring a couple projects that I also am very proud of, of bringing to you guys and making it exclusive. Uh, is that on October 23rd? Uh, this face I cannot say much, but you're going to see me on the new video game. The biggest video game in the world is called Medal of Honor, an exclusive for you. Wow. Medal of Honor. This face is going to be in every single where, including trailers, and I cannot say much about it because, uh, you, uh, seriously, I, I, I just want to tell you something. It's one of the biggest uh, anticipated. Wait, wait. I think you're playing the bad guy. You know no, I can't. No. You know you cannot come on here and say it's an exclusive and talk about yes. one of the hottest games. But you know Medal what? Of Honor like okay, that. if they sue me, okay. I mean, you're not going to pay the bills. Uh, they, uh, they will definitely sue me. But I tell you something no, but see, that's because a I huge asked. Game. Well, okay, what's it like being part of that video game? You I mean, know what? I tell you that much. Yeah. Seriously, uh, I'm really so honored to be in it because it was first time they put all kinds of dots around my face and they did all the mo motion capture, which is was uh, interesting. And 360 Xbox, it's like they have like around 240 cameras all around to take visual. Visually, is going to be, I mean, untouchable. And what's what's interesting about it that it's, it's a game that deals with what's happening right now. It's, it's really I'm really excited about it. But I, I will definitely tell you something: the day that it will come out or the day they want me to promote it, I will be coming back and I'll give you a call wherever I okay. will be at. I promise yeah. you that much. But also I need to tell you something. Wait, wait, I have a question though yes. that you can answer, and you won't get in trouble for this. Okay, good. Okay, as an actor, what is it like working on a video game? versus in a movie great uh, why they hire me because when I want audition for it uh, they actually wanted somebody that because of the video games is more physically mm -hmm. but what I gave them an audition it was more of like an actor but I still did that physical which is it was brilliant and they changed a lot of the concept because uh, it's have real emotions going in it mm -hmm. and this is what they like so so even my face is is emo is it's like a uh, like a visual uh, it it was really the emotion being uh, the emotions in it being captured mm -hmm. i mean to the max and which is i'm really so proud about it i'm really so excited to be part of ea and to be part of this family and i also want to give you something that <laughs> i'm really excited about because because i have so many i don't want to forget anything i have i have a couple of films that a few films one of them is called uh, cross purpose yeah. with a very good friend of mine his name is patrick uh, reddy he's the director and he's the writer of the script and i also want to say that i'm co-producer and i have my uh, steve owens my manager to be an uh, the associate producer in it and next year also driving force entertainment which is my management company uh, i'm i'm involved with a brilliant film that i'm really so excited trying to bring her in it's called vespucci uh, it's it's uh, it's amrito vespucci is a 
very huge big film going to be beyond expectation because it's going to be in Italy we're going to shoot it for six months by the brilliant director his name is Lorenzo Ravigi which is he also is going to have me work in the film is called uh, Machiavelli uh, oh, I mean wow. yeah uh, and and it's going to be my first film to speak in Italian. So I mean, between these two, I Do want to. Do you get to, to be Machiavelli? I'm going. You know, I tell you something. For that, I can tell you something. I'm going to be his father. I'm playing his father. Ooh, that so, should be a juicy role. So 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 I'm honored to to Lorenzo. Lorenzo, I love you. We go. And he's coming. By the way, he's coming back here in September uh, for the first time to to United States. And I'm going to bring him a red carpet fan. And I definitely will tell you. Thank you so much for this interview. Thank you very much. And thank you very much thank for interviewing you. Thank you very much. We're looking forward to catching you. Both of you. Some thank very you. interesting movies and of course the game. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank you. It was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you.